I just want to give you a little update on my Meyer lemon cuttings. These lemon cuttings have been sitting here in my solo cup greenhouse system for about six months maybe. And we are gonna go ahead and open it up and see what we have. Okay. So what happened is over time, I had already pulled open the plastic so it could breathe. And here we have the cup. And now we have the moment of truth. So we had three cuttings in this cup. One of the cuttings absolutely didn't make it. But two of these cuttings in this cup have been living this way for six months. Many months later. And we see we have roots coming out of the bottom. So let's go ahead and see what our progress is. After about six months. So we just went on ahead and dumped that out. And on our first one, we see there's definitely roots. Okay. Our second one died. And our third one also has roots. Oh my God! Wow! So we're gonna go ahead and repot these guys. And pot them up. What I'm using now is a uh, upcycled vegetable planter. Same thing as this cup, but this cup's been sitting here for a while. And what I did is I've got perlite in here, mixed in. So I'm gonna put a little bit of that wet cocoa core because it's got the biology going. And we're just gonna go ahead and put that lemon plant in here with its roots. Top it off. So that's one of these lemon plants, Meyer lemon. And we're going to go ahead and do the same thing for the second one. Gonna get some of our potting medium. And the roots are kind of small on this one, a little more delicate. But the uh, diameter of this cutting is a little thicker. I put a little bit of that cocoa core back in there so that the roots can have some of that same chemistry and biology going on around the roots that were in the cup. Top that off. So, this again is Meyer lemon, and these were cuttings from one of my Meyer lemon trees. So, we're going to keep an eye on these cuttings and see how they grow. I'm continuing them inside of my clear containers so we can see the roots and how the roots develop. But I'm pretty happy that we've got success on two out of three of our last cuttings that we did. So that's 66% success rate
Just by taking cuttings off of a Meyer lemon tree and using my system that I explained to you guys in a previous video. I will do my best to put a link in the description to my previous video on Meyer lemon cuttings. But here we see that we have a 66% success ratio, that's two thirds. Yeah. And it could have been higher. Um, one of the things when dealing with citrus cuttings is you gotta let them go for a while. And if I had them in a greenhouse or some other kind of nursery system, perhaps they would have done better. These guys were just sitting in my windowsill my kitchen windowsill for six months inside of my solo cup greenhouse I changed the water periodically but I didn't change it every day it was just something that was done periodically Now you all know me, I like to recycle and reuse things. So what we're gonna go ahead and do is we're going to recycle. This is just a food service cup. And we're gonna do the same method as was done before. This cup has drainage holes, this cup does not. So we're gonna go ahead and put it in there, okay? And there's a little air gap at the bottom. So what will happen is when we water, excess water will drain into this reservoir and it'll be a sort of a self-watering system because when the excess water drains into the reservoir, it'll then be able to be re-absorbed into the pot. We're going to go ahead and do that for both of these.
break my heart I give you all my treasure, love